Hello Blender people and welcome back to another video on Blenderpedia. Um, today we're gonna make an American flag with wind blowing uh, effects through it. And to show you what it looks like, I made a sample video playing it and you see the flag falling down and the wind is blowing through it and it's really nice. I hope so. And there is a nice skyline on the background and a blue sky and that's what we're going to make. Uh, before we get started, I want to ask you to sign up on my YouTube uh, account. I want to have more members, because uh, I want to make more videos, and if you sign up, I make them. So you sign up, and I will do the work. Uh, for now, we get started and erasing this cube in the middle, adding a mesh plane, and scale it. Um, we go to the side view, and we're making a cylinder. Yes, we need a cylinder to make this possible. And we go to the Z mode, so we can see the bottom and scale it more. Yes, this is good enough. Um, bring it there and we are selecting the top of the cylinder and put it right there. Right, cool, cool, cool. Um, we need to change the top of the cylinder. Uh, scale it, region, region, scale it. And that's enough. Cool. Scale it. Right. Go to the uh, object mode and add another plane. Well, this is going to be the flag. Yes. Rotating it right there. Cool. And go to this view. And we're putting it into the cylinder flag thing. Um, I'm scaling it a bit because we want to make it real and pressing it right there, Control L and we go to the F9 button and then we have this panel and we want to subdivide it press it five times, it looks like this and now we go to this button and the physics button whoa, cool, pressing close, press it pinning off close and now we're doing the next part and that is weed painting what is it? Well, it's it's a nice future in Blender, and when I'm pressing it, I'm bringing wheat on it, so... Right there. Can we fall down on that point? Um, go to the object mode, and what we're going to do now is go to collision and enable self collisions. Cool. Well, for now, this is the flag, I want to do one more thing, and that is put on a beautiful American flag on it. Press image, open the American flag. If you want, if you want to put on a Japanese flag, it's also good if you just put on a flag. I did something wrong, it's a blender bug, just do it again. Because now it's fitting much better. They have to change the blender. Really. It's a really cool program, but that is really freaking me out all the time. Cool. Right there. This is the flag. I'm not making a render because that uh, it's not the, the way it is. Um, what I have to do now is making the cool part is making a wind machine. Yes. Well, take a look. What I'm doing is go to the field on the physics button and make wind. Nothing happened. Right. You think you have to make this one. Fall off is one. Strength is make it. 25. And now we're turning it right there and looks what happened when I make it solid and I put on the... I forgot to make it text face so select the flag and make it text face. Look what happened when I'm pressing all A. It's falling down and then the wind is blowing through the flag. You see? This is really cool. Um, well, for now I'm pressing this button and I want to do the next part, and that is making buildings mesh a cube. Scale it and go to the side view, and we are putting it on the ground, selecting those, and put it up. Put it up. Right there. A bit more. A bit more. Ctrl L, U. Uh, I want cube projection. And looks what we got, American flag on our building. 
I don't want the American flag. I want to have this texture. Control L the texture and put them all together. Because when you do that, you've got a nice. Well, this is the roof. I think we don't need that uh, piece. Um, this thing. You have to do it one more time because when we are finished we duplicate it. Well this is enough, just select those and those and control L. That's all you have to do. Scale it and put it right there. Cool. Now we go add text face at 5x text face and now we're going to texture and you're seeing the building. I want to change the camera and making a cool view this is what I want right there alright and I'm moving those buildings into the view I duplicate it and put on this building another texture just go to edit mode UV image editor it's on the right place Im open uh, another texture building it's another one 3D view, it's a bit different. Um, I want to have it here. Looks where it goes. I want it there. No, there. And I duplicate it right here. I want to see it. Cool. This building is pissing me off. I want to have it. Make it smaller. Cool. And I'm making a render and yeah this looks shit really okay doesn't matter because we need to change everything a bit all right this building also a bit here we're gonna change the lights and I'm selecting this light to make it this is lamp I'm making it Sun ray shadow four samples rotating it and putting it right here and of course we want a nice blue sky so we're pressing sky atmosphere sky um, this is enough I'm putting the energy a bit down I don't want a lot of energy right here and right there so I'm pressing this view um, and before I get started I go to game no game record game physics to IPO and now I'm pressing uh, solid and pressing all A and the flag is falling and the wind is blowing wait to its finish now it's finished cool pressing escape put on the camera a bit more right there I want to see the wall flag okay I'm gonna finish go to F10 um, make this AVJPEG you can change the OZ to 16 and make your own I want to make it more this cool this is it and uh, I'm making the final render well now my render is uh, ready uh, and I'm clicking on it this is what we made I'm clicking on the play button and it's falling down it's a bit uh, a bit mesh so you have to change it on your own way um, Try it a lot of times and make it cool. Uh, but this is the basic and if you got questions you can always ask me. Well, see you later in the next tutorial video on Blenderpedia. Bye.